Oh, hi guys, how are you? I was reading the book of Jonah. This story is amazing. I can't wait to share with you guys about this story. But before I'm going to talk about the story of Jonah, I have something to show you about the event that happened to me last week. Let's watch it together. Jessie! Yeah? Jessie, Jessie, hmm. I've lost my taro. You lost your taro? Yes, my taro. Oh, I'm so sorry to hear that. Yeah. So, um, how can I help you now? Can you help me find it? Um, of course. Let's find it together. Okay. Tonight. Let's try again tomorrow morning. Is it okay? okay. Alright. Um, why don't we pray together that you have a good sleep tonight and pray that we can find it tomorrow morning. Okay, let's pray. Who is Taro? What's Taro? How did you guys find the story? I was very happy that I could help Renee even though we couldn't find the Taro, um, her favorite toy, on that day. But I think Renee was quite happy that I was able to help her and comfort her. I was really really excited when I mess received a message from Renee that she finally found Taro and could sleep by holding him in her arms. But what would have happened if I didn't offer help? Hmm. Jessie! Hmm? Jessie, 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 yeah, Jessie, Jessie! Yeah, what, what, what happened? Jessie! Yes, Jessie! Yes, tell me what you want. I've lost my taro. You lost your taro? Yes, my taro. I've lost it. Uh, so what? what? Jessie! Yeah, yeah, I've lost you... my taro. Okay, what do you want? Can you help me find it? No. Please, Jessie! Jessie, you know it's my time! I'm really busy now, so you're going to look for it by yourself. Okay. I felt so bad just imagining that what could possibly happen to Renee if I didn't offer help. Renee probably had to off, um, find her toy all by herself, and she must have been really, really sad if I wasn't there. I'm so glad that I could help her. Today, we're going to talk about that God is compassionate. God understands how we feel, cares, and helps us when we are in need. Indeed, there are many, many ways God offers help for us. But one of the ways God offers help for His people is for us to help one another. When someone is in need, we can show our compassion toward them, like how I helped Renee when she is in need. Two weeks ago, our church learned about the story of Jonah. Let's think what do I remember about the story of Jonah. Hmm, I know a good place to start. Let's think about who was in the story. There was Jonah, God, and do you remember anyone else in there? I think... The Ninevites and a big fish. Well done. Cool. So I remember people and places, but what happened? God tells Jonah to go to Nineveh um, to tell people that God will destroy Nineveh in 40 days because God saw them um, living there in their own ways, not to follow God's ways. So God was upset about his people and he wanted to do something for them. But what did Jonah do? Jonah said, no thanks, and he went to Tarshish instead. At the end, Jonah was thrown, thrown into the sea and swallowed by a big fish that God sent. Finally, Jonah obeyed to God and went to Nineveh um, to tell people that they need to repent. And people listened to Jonah. People said sorry um, for, the li for living their way, and they repent and turn away from their evil ways. From the story of Jonah, we could learn that God has a great compassion for his people. He did not choose to destroy the Nineveh. Instead, he chose to forgive them and give them second chance and to teach them to do the right thing. 
I'm so thankful for God that He has great compassion for us, for all of us. God sent His one and only Son, Jesus Christ, to forgive us and to teach the right things. So from the story of Jonah, we can learn that we can help other people, like how God offers help for His people. I'll wrap up with prayer. Let's pray together. Please God, help us to be loving towards our neighbors the way you are loving towards us. Amen. I hope you guys enjoyed the lesson today and I will see you guys next week. Bye! I can't find my taro! Tara, are you a favorite toy? My taro! Wait, you're not supposed to know. <laughs> Okay, keep going.